Hi, this is Eric with Globe Runner Search Engine Optimization, and today I'm here at a really exciting event. It's a Media Masterminds event, and today I'm sitting here with Pete Sorensen from Ginkgo Enterprises, and he's a enterprise consultant uh, doing mergers and acquisitions. He has a lot of great experience, and I just wanted to tap his knowledge a little bit and see how some of his business intersected with search engine optimization, web marketing, and what he's dealing with. So, Pete, when, when you're talking to companies and you're consulting with them, tell me, how are they feeling about their online presence? How is that changing in your years of experience? Well, it, uh, Eric, it's really kind of interesting because uh, over the last three to five years, it seems like people are beginning to experience a significant amount of anxiety about how they present themselves in the marketplace, the, the electronic or the, the ether, the, the cloud marketplace. Absolutely, there. yeah. And, uh, and one of the things, it was, it was uh, I'm a baby boomer, so it was hard for us to get used to even using computers, and now all of a sudden, people are telling us, oh my gosh, you've gotta be on the net, and, and then all of a sudden we find out Oh, I just don't have to put up a website. People have to be able to access my website. Yeah, right, absolutely. And, and they've got to have content that they can use, my customers and prospects, but also they've got to be able to know how to access it. And there has to be all these keyword searches and, and, and then this SEO or SOE or S -E SEO, yeah. SEO, <laughs> SEO. <laughs> Well, let me tell you two stories that I think will kind of get to where I see this as being a big issue. I'm on two boards of directors uh, for nonprofit organizations. One of them deals with third world development. Yeah. Uh, and uh, it, it's, a, it's a wonderful organization doing great humanitarian work. And what's the name of the organization? Help International. Help International. I've heard of that. That is a really fantastic organization. A great little outfit and doing some wonderful work. Uh, we've got a presence now uh, in uh, uh, Uganda. Uh, we're going into India and Thailand this year. Second time in Thailand. We were there after the tsunami. Uh, El Salvador and Fiji. Uh, and we'll try to go into Belize this year. Well, the, the thing that's, that's uh, we have a wonderful story to tell, but how do people access it? Absolutely. And if we don't get it on the web, and on the web in a way that people can relate to it, and especially because we're using young people as volunteers, college age right. young people as volunteers. And so we just went through a branding kind of discussion about, well, our logo's old. No, our logo isn't old, it's only five years old. And, and the younger people in the, on the board are saying, that's really old. <laughs> and us baby boomers are saying, that's not old. And, and so we have gone through this decision about the branding and now we've got the new website up and it really does look good. And, and we're, we're putting up YouTube stuff and we're doing, you know, we're, we're doing all the right things. But this, all of a sudden, this whole notion of optimization, not just having a website, yeah. but getting to, how do people have access to that information That's so great. they can use it? Well, and your, to your point, if I was a, um, you know, 18, 20 something, and I wanted to volunteer and go across country, you know, I might think, well, I want to join the Peace Corps. Well, here's a really exciting opportunity. How would I find out about that? Yeah. The first thing I do is I go to my computer, I look for international volunteer opportunities, and I'd hope that uh, your nonprofit came up. So that's a fantastic example. Thank you so much, Pete. I really appreciate you uh, spending a few minutes with us today. This has been Globe Runner, uh, Globe Runner Search Engine Optimization. My name's Eric McGarrity. Please visit our website at globerunnerseo.com, and I'm going to put a link uh, back to the different uh, nonprofits we talked about today and, and Pete's company, Gecko Enterprises. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it.